Hi everyone, in this video I am going to show you a quick tip on how to promote your eBay listing for sponsor listing. What I mean by that is basically you pay a certain amount to eBay to promote your listing. And how does this work? Let me open up another uh, another tab and to show you now if I go to my eBay section okay and uh, here I am logged in to my account so what I do I normally will log out to show you this now if I do a search for one of my items here I have a Timberland man six inch waterproof with leather ankle boots so that's one of my listing now if I do that, now here we are, as you can see, I have got a listing under all the Timber, all the Timberland shoes, men shoe, as you can see there's a list of all the sellers with their Timberland shoes. Now as you can see on top of this listing, now as you can see is this is my listing for that pair of um, Timberland boots I talked about now this is the now that's my listing on my eBay store and the bottom here is a listing for sponsored listing which I I pay for to list my item sponsored like this is sponsored which means that is my listing I pay to eBay for advertising so that's why my listing came on top of this all of the Timberlands and I'm going to show you how we do that now so if we switch back to the other screen now here I'm going to my account and this is my account here as you can see right now what you do you go to your Sellers dashboard. So you go to the sales page. All right. So it seems I'm logged off. So I have to log back in again. Ready. Now we have to log in back in again. So we're going to log back to my account again. All right. Here we are. Now we're into the sellers hub. There we go. This is all my item listed item over here. I have 465, I think, at the moment. Now, what we do here is you go to marketing, press marketing, and on your left hand side panel here, um, you come down to advertising, promote your listing. See, see here. You have to press this button and in turn another open another windows opens up and here I have all my promoted listings so as you can see I have four four campaign four campaign no here I have four four campaign 449 list list promoted uh, 2212 clicks I've sold 16 items now the ad fee for selling that 16 items is £10.26 which is this ad fee is top of the 10% fee eBay you have to pay eBay so basically what it is it's nothing to do with the 10% fee this is extra I'm paying for those promoted listings out of those listings the amount is sold 16 so the eBay charged £10.26 for that 16 sold so the many as I sold they will charge you this amount uh, and it depends how many percentage I've selected so I'm going to show you this so what we do so so far it's so good so I've sold 16 of these items uh, the eight extra eight fees £10.26 uh, the 16 items came to £187.79 there we go now we're going to create a new campaign so 
refresh creating new campaign you don't have to worry about this on your right, uh, right hand side because this is uh, for very very large sellers like 25,000 list we don't have 25,000 list we have only got a couple of hundred so we'll use this uh, select uh, select listing individually so we go select list individually and here we are these are the items I can promote for now because of the other lot I've already promoted so here it gives you all this item to promote and their prices uh, so what I do I'll select here all of this let's select it click the select button here and then you go down here and you set set ad rate there we go now basically what it means ad rate is how much you're willing to pay for your how much you're willing to pay eBay for selling your items so these these items are set at five percent at the moment look all of them are set at five percent now you can set them up to twenty percent look if we go to twenty percent and as you can see the figure changes now for the item three pound fifty if you pay eBay twenty percent to promote your listing this listing and if that's listing sold then eBay will charge you extra 70 pence because this they promoted this item and it's sold so they will pay charge you extra 70 pence for it so in turn you'll pay eBay 10% out of £3.50 which is 35 pence on top of 70 pence for advertising so basically what you do for £3.50 you'll be paying a a pound towards eBay and that's 10 percent their fees and 20 percent for advertising so that's how it works obviously I am not going to put 20 percent in everything some of these items look this here for example a um, baseball cap I'm selling at 11.99 so if I pay them 20 percent I'll be paying 2.40 now here I got some McDonald's Coca-Cola glasses at 19.99 now if you pay 20% out of that you'll be paying for quid. Was it worth it? No, it's not worth it. So what you do, they give you a trend. And trend is how many, if I put apply trend, that means how many people are sponsoring that sort of item on eBay and they set a trending is selling on that price. So what I tend to normally do, you can put look, set your target at one and one and one point nine percent which is seven pence some are five pence look depends on the price of the item the slider like one point nine at ten ninety nine I'll be paying twenty one pence if I sold this item for advertising for eBay so I tend to roughly use five percent so I put five percent as you can see this um, badge now if I were to sell this badge, then I have to pay 18 pence on top of the 10 percent they will charge. So basically what I'm doing, I'll be paying eBay 15 percent, 10 percent for the final fee and 5 percent for advertising. So if you go down, now what do we look at the Coca-Cola glass? Yeah, we look at the Coca-Cola glass at uh, 19.99, 5 percent of that is pound. So if I were to sell that Coca-Cola glass within the time scale, then I would be paying a pound to for the advertising fee plus the ten percent of that. So again here baseball becomes sixty pence. So I hope you everyone understood that. So what we're gonna do now as I said, it all depends on your budget. You can put up to 20% if you like. You can put the more percentage, the higher percentage it is, the more higher chances of you selling the product. Simple as that. So we go down and then we review our products. Now we now you can name your campaign anything you want. Campaign number five, campaign number six, campaign starting today. So They'll give you a starting date, so I've selected today. And today being the November 14th, 2017, and end date I'm going to put down end of this month, so 30th November. There you go. So that's about 
just just over a week or so. Oh, yeah, it's about 16 days. Right, two weeks or so. There we go, and now what we do, we launched our campaign. We launch it, and here we go. As you can see now, our listing promoter has gone up to 463. I have five campaigns, and obviously, the more I sell, this is the extra fee for eBay, and they will start listing promoting my product. And that's how you promote your listing on eBay. If you have a shop, you have to have a shop, eBay shop, to promote your listing. And eBay tend to, the more listing you do, the more sales you do slowly, they will invite you to promote your listing. eBay don't, don't just willy-nilly give you the chance to start promoting your listings. So if you have a shop and you're thinking of promoting your listing, this is the only, this is the another way of promoting. There's another way of doing it. If you are not sure if you know, it's Markdown Manager. It's a different one and I'll show you next time in a different video how to do that. So I hope you like this video and all of my other videos. Please click like and subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching this video and all of my other videos. If you like any help, please leave a comment behind and I will try to answer it for you. Once again, thank you so much.